tonight I'm going to be trying um, the Wine Direct Number One Rosé for Summer. Um, it's, an, it's a wine called Chateau Riotard. Um, Chateau Riotard owned by Chateau Montmédon, based in Chateau Neuf de Pape in France. Um, Riotard are located in Provence, um, of course the most famous place in the world for producing rosé. Um, this is a blend of Grenache, Syrah and Cinso. Um, these are the um, superior uh, grapes used in um, Provence, so trying to get rid of grapes like Carignan because um, it makes an old-fashioned, um, inferior style of uh, rosé. Um, this wine is made using the Saguenay method, which is where um, they blend off the free-run juice um, after they crush the grapes. They then leave the grapes um, in contact, uh, the grape skins in contact with the juice for enough time to get this lovely salmon pink colour um, coloured wine. The juice is then removed and fermented and um, you have this beautiful rosé. Um, okay, so now onto the wine itself. Um, yep, salmon colour in appearance. Um, lovely, light, kind of fresh looking wine. Okay, so now onto the nose. <sighs> well, you get an explosion of summer fruits. Raspberries, strawberries, strawberries and cream, um, honey, vanilla. A really, really complex nose on this one. Take a second sniff and you pick up something slightly more unusual, some menthol, um, some kind of pistachio um, aniseed smells. Okay, so now on to the palette. Amazing acid, totally harmonised, not too austere, not flabby. You get, again, a lot of honey, strawberries, raspberries, some delicious primary fruit, and then a kind of aftertaste of something more intriguing, like fennel, a touch of fennel, some kind of almond taste. A lot going on with this rosé, and the thing I love about it is that it's a definite aperitif or a food wine. I think it will go perfectly with oysters and any um, fish dishes, um, not too heavy, um, sushi, um, Asian food, um, I think even strawberries and cream, you can do so much with this wine and for the price, it's really a winner for the summer.